All right, all right, all right. Welcome to the Intuitive Empress channel. I am Intuitive Empress. Thank you for coming to the table to get this spiritual food that is being served up today. Keep in mind, this is a general message for my Capricorns. Take what resonates and leave the rest. In other words, eat the meat and don't be caught up on that bone. All right, and I can be speaking to your past, present, and or future energies during this read. Thank you, thank you, thank you to my subscribers. You are much appreciated. Thank you so much for my returning viewers and new viewers. Welcome, welcome to the channel. Please do subscribe and hit that bell notification so you know when the next video is available. If you like how I read and you like this or you like this message, please Hit that like button and comment down in the comment section. That being said, let's get to it. <clears throat> All right. So... First out, we had Taurus hit the deck. So you could have Taurus in your chart or you could be dealing with a Taurus. All right. All right. So we have more earth energy with the King of Pentacles. This is someone who is faithful, wealthy, and is someone who commits to what they set out to do. Hmm. There is a lot going on here. Um, possibly Capricorn, you could have um, been in a relationship with someone who had you had conflict with, some tension, someone who played mind games, okay, which made you feel defeated in this relationship, okay? So you went into hermit mode, withdrew from the situation in a quest for spiritual illumination and getting some inner wisdom okay so we have um judgment that has happened in this situation this is a situation where you have been seeking your inner calling seeking to have a rebirth <clears throat> Dealing with your higher self. This is all that you've gone through during this hermit period. And it has made some strides in this relationship. And I just have to just put this over here. Prior to going into that mode, you did feel the eight of swords energy. Some mental backup, uh, backup in your mind. Those things that... <clears throat> made you feel victimized and trapped in the situation. This is what caused you to go into hermit mode so that you could regroup. Okay. And it led to the world being turned into your favor. Some success. You may be traveling completion of cycles. Okay. Completion of those things that no longer serve you. You have gotten a renewed hope in your life, some healing. You strengthened your faith in the most high when you were getting your spiritual wisdom. Okay. You were getting guidance from him and it's leading to the ace of pentacles for you. Very, very good energy here. Having a fresh start. Okay. And for many of you, you will have a new beginning in love. So someone else will be coming in to um basically give you love the love that you did not get in the past all right and i just broke my nail so look something in your life broke okay you may be getting a breakthrough in your life All right, so you could be 39 or someone around you could be 39. 39 could be significant. 
Um, you will be getting help from the community, um, your uh, friends, maybe some business partnerships, things that will be healed in your family, in your household. Okay. You also may will be getting victory in a court situation. So for some of you, you may have been um, going through um, a divorce. You may have been going through custody battles, child support. Things are going to be working out for your favor, Capricorn. All right. So let's get a little bit more on this situation here. All right, so we have a lot that came out here. We have someone in the past was, um, someone in the past, it's funny, I said past and I didn't even, someone in the past that you have history with um, was, stonewalling you, not taking action, non-committal. Okay. Um, you may currently not be speaking to this person because they were harsh. They were extreme and cutting you off. They were making erratic decisions regarding this situation, causing you pain. Okay. Causing you to be guarded and apprehensive when it came to love, when it came to this person. All right. This person um, just kept their feelings to themselves. So I'm feeling that there's someone here who had feelings for you, but did not show it to you. Um, someone who um, you really had feelings for someone who really had feelings for you. OK, this is someone who may have been quick to anger. OK, because of past issues that they had when it came to love. OK, so upon meeting you, they were not so trusting. OK, this is someone who um, can get very angry, can explode through temper tantrums and things like that, sending you on a roller coaster of emotions. OK, the highest highs, the lowest lows. The good and the bad of rush of feelings, someone that was in and out of the relationship. Um, and this is someone who um, you may have been getting signs. They were getting have been getting signs that you are uh, the one. OK, now they want to be totally focused on you. OK, they're observing you and watching you because now they have a revelation that. You are a reflection of them. You are mirrored souls. You are twin flames. Um, and this person is going to want to have a new beginning in love with you, a fresh start. This person has overwhelming emotions for you that comes in waves that crashes against their soul. Okay. So... This crash of emotions is what makes this person unpredictable, okay? They were not expecting to have such strong feelings for you, okay? So they caused you undue pain as they went back and forth, okay? And the thing about it is it was repeated cycles, okay? So you have history with this person. Again, 
things that happened in the past, repeated patterns, feelings of deja vu with this person. Now you could have a family with this person. Okay. Or this person could have had children prior to meeting you and vice versa. Okay. But this person feels at home with you. They do feel like you are family. They feel safe with you, whether they let you know that or not. Okay. And I feel like they, they did not let you know because they were in their ego. Um, a lot of pride um, is involved in this situation. OK, and so this person is blind to the truth, blind to what they're doing to you. OK, but they're watching you online. They're wanting to know if you're with someone else. They're searching for those answers. All right. Um, it's very interesting um, that this person is like this uh, with you. OK, Um Let's just get a couple of situation cards here. What is going on in this situation with Capricorn? All right. So again, we have the family card and I'm really getting that, um, for some of you, you may have children with this person because you have the blood tie. But for others of you, I really do feel like this person sees you as family, sees you as um, a safe place, feels like they're at home with you, even though they did not es express it. This person is still um, a, a short fuse and they're ready to explode because they don't know what's going on. Some of you may have even moved on. All right. And causing this person to want to retaliate against you, to pay you back for breaking their heart and causing them pain, even though this was pain that they caused on their own. Um, this is someone who is frustrated. Um, they feel uh, trapped and closed in and stuck, but you are protected um, from your heavenly angels, okay? So you are prevented from harm and divine intervention has taken place or will take place in your life, okay? Um, but this person, because they are feeling the pressure, because they may not necessarily um, be able to get to you like they want to get to you, they are about to come and confess and reveal their true feelings for you. Okay. All right. So let's just we have a Leo. So you could be dealing with a Leo. You could have Leo somewhere in your chart, Capricorn. We have Thursday. So something could have happened with a Leo on a Thursday or will happen with a Leo on a Thursday. This could be when this person reveals things. Um, you have a strong connection to the most high. Um, you communicate with the most high throughout the day. So that might be why you're getting uh, when you're getting your downloads from the most high about this twin flame situation. Um, this person in the past could have mocked you because of your spiritual um, connection. Because you have a strong intuition. All right. For many of you, this person needs healing um, from the past so they can accept love. OK, we have um, you going within, taking the time um, to learn and grow from the past. And this is what this person needs to do. Um, there is divine energy around you and in this situation. All right, so you could be going through a rebirth or this person could be going through a rebirth. This person really just needs to uh, take the time to um, do the work that needs to be done um, in their life. And I think that's the problem. This person definitely wanted the easy way out. Um, so 
Mm. Spirit is telling you because right now I believe many of you are in separation with this person to just focus on your goals. OK, while you focusing on your goals, you're getting um, more hope, more strength, um, more abundance. OK, um, for many of you, this person is caught up with a succubus spirit or this person could have it. But I'm also see, just seeing that this is a karmic female. So the succubus spirit is a karmic female that is doing a psychic attack. And I just got a notification on that. OK, so your person is caught up in some things um, when it comes to um, a third party and karmic energy. This person needs to turn away from darkness. OK, and this succubus spirit Um you are connected with this person. And so you are feeling certain things, some tiredness, um, maybe some mental attacks, maybe feeling mentally drained, feeling like your thoughts are being snatched from you. Um, this karmic energy is also mocking. You could possibly be a Taurus or a Leo in energy. OK, but this person is thinking about you. OK, even though they are in their ego, they need to drop their ego. And I believe at first when it came to this karmic energy, your person was blind to what they were doing, but now they're getting signs and synchronicities. They are thinking about the history that you had. They're on the verge of just blowing up. Okay. They are feeling the pain of how harsh they were with you and how cold they were with you. Okay. They want to put it out on the table and any retaliation that may come from this karmic energy um, has been blocked by the Holy Spirit. All right. So that is the message that I have for you, Capricorn. Thank you so much for joining me for this meal that has been spread out for you. Um, and hopefully it helps you on your journey. Please do like this video, comment in the comment section, and I'll see you next time.